You've learned about cataract surgery. Let's say you've picked a lens and you've had a great outcome, but what, what do you expect after the surgery? So you will go home the same day. It's one day surgery. Usually it takes about 30 minutes or so, and you can expect to go to the ambulatory if it's an ambulatory or surgical center, but the surgical center a couple of hours before your surgery. Surgery takes about 30 minutes, and then you stay there for 30, 40 minutes, um, and then you go home that same uh, afternoon or evening. Expect to wear a patch or a shield overnight. Uh, and then every doctor has, you know, their own in a drop regimen, but you will be on drops um, for around four weeks. And again, uh, some people may do three, some people may do two, some people may do six, but around four weeks and some form of an antibiotic and an anti-inflammatory drop. In terms of activity restrictions, these are usually for one to two weeks. Um, and the restrictions are weight-bearing activities, usually anything more than 10, 15 pounds, um, no bending or inversions like yoga, stretching. Um, you wanna avoid high impact activities like running, um, avoid swimming, and then eye makeup as well for one to two weeks. But the things that you can do uh, per your comfort, you can drive if you're comfortable, if you feel like your vision is clear enough, TV, reading, computer, just walking around, these are all okay depending on your comfort level after the surgery. And then in terms of how many visits you have to have after the surgery, uh, you'll, you'll always be seen the day after surgery. And then usually you'll, you'll be seen at one or two weeks. Um, this visit, depending on how you look at the uh, on day one, uh, can be skipped or often we're actually doing a lot of them by phone now. Um, and then you will have an in-person visit uh, at four to six weeks, either with the ophthalmologist that did your surgery or an optometrist, because this will be your final post-op check. And then you'll also get the, your glasses prescription if you need one at this point. So, you know, you, people always ask, you know, how, how long do I have to wait for my new glasses? Usually about four weeks. So everything's settled and you're well healed. Um, and if both eyes are being done, again, everyone has different regimens on how they space the eyes apart, but on average, um, if you're not doing them both on the same day, which some people are doing now, including us, um, but if you're doing them separately, on average, usually about two weeks apart. So if you're thinking about, if I do my eyes two weeks apart, when am I gonna get my glasses? About six weeks. And then just after you know, you're all done, you've got your glasses prescription, what do you do then? You should still, of course, get yearly eye exams just for annuals, especially if you have any other eye conditions that need to be monitored. Um, cataracts do not come back um, and the lens doesn't have an expiration date or it doesn't need to be re replaced. It's there forever um, unless there's some sort of trauma. The one thing that can happen is called, it's something that's known as PCO or posterior capsular opacification. And what this is, is if you remember from Dr. Ramanathan's analogy, you know, we have that M&M and we leave that that candy coating intact, right? We take everything out from the inside and we put the implant in its place. Sometimes that candy coating, the back part of that candy coating can get cloudy. And that's what posterior capsular pacification is. And, you know, sometimes it's referred to as a membrane, sometimes it's referred to as clouding or scar tissue, but it's essentially clouding of the back part of that capsule. Um, so symptomatically, it feels like you're getting your cataract back because if you can imagine if the capsule is cloudy or that shell is cloudy, your vision is going to be blurry again. Um, and this top picture is what it looks like, just a clouding, and that clouding is in that the, the capsule or the shell of that lens. Um, and this is a very in-off treatable um, it, uh, condition in the office. It's just done with a laser in the office. It's called a YAG laser capsulotomy, where essentially we use a laser to kind of break up that scar tissue or that membrane and just create a clear central opening so then that your visual axis is clear again and then you can see clearly again. Um, and again, this is just a five to 10 minute procedure done in the office. You go, you get it done, you go home the same day, no restrictions.